What, what we've learned about creating our circles of trust is that we have to work hard to articulate ground rules that help maintain safe space for the soul because our culture is an invasive culture and inner work when it's not rightly done makes people vulnerable it ends up with people feeling exploited they never want to come into that space again and that's why I emphasize rightly done so we have ground rules like in this circle there shall be no fixing no saving no advising and no setting straight we simply won't do those things that drive the soul back into hiding the soul doesn't want to be fixed saved advised set straight the soul wants to be witnessed it wants to be received it wants to be heard it wants to be honored that's all and so we learn to be present to each other in a way that that makes that possible by observing this very simple ground rule we have a, another ground rule that instead of doing all those things we will learn to ask each other honest open questions the kinds of questions that hear each other into speech and people in our circles of trust have learned that while it sounds simple to, to ask an honest open question it's actually a very demanding art um, have you thought about seeing a therapist is not an honest open question <laughs> It's a little piece of advice in disguise. Have, here's a, have, you, have you read this book is not an honest, open question. There's so many subtle ways to kind of slip in what's really an effort to advise or fix. So an honest, open question is one that you can ask without possibly sitting here thinking to yourself, I know the right answer to this question, and I sure hope you give it to me. So if you say, have you ever had an experience like this before in your life? That's an honest, open question. If you have, what did you learn from it that might be useful to you now? That's an honest, open question. You said you felt angry. What does that word mean to you, and where does that come from for you? That's an honest, open question. These are the kinds of questions that, that help hear that other person into speech, that invite the soul to say the next deeper thing, the next deeper thing, and the next deeper thing. And it's our way of serving the soul in our circles of trust.